what's up you guys today i'm going to be dyeing my hair as you guys saw by the title of this video uh yeah disclaimer this video is not a tutorial i'm just going to be showing you how i'm doing this whole process i am technically a um professional i do have my license for cosmetology so i do have some knowledge when it comes to these things i did study for this so yeah, I'm, this is not a tutorial, I'm not teaching you how to do it, but if you decide to do it, it's on you, boo. I'm going to be using bleach and all that stuff, so I'm in a well-ventilated area, and if you're going to be doing this at home, you should, but I don't recommend you do. Let a professional do your hair, but um, yeah, I'm going to be using the Paul Mitchell um, Ultra Quick Blue Lightener. This is bleach. I'm going to be using 40 Volume Developer. Um, I have a bowl and brush. I have um, some gloves. And I have the hair dye I'm going to be using. This is a Manic Panic Electric Lizard Dye. I used this on my side cut a while back. And another thing, I also have foil because since it is this, I'm going to be dyeing my bag. So I'm going to put foil right here so I won't burn my face off because chemical burns are a thing. That's another thing if you're doing this at home and if something's burning, something's itching, something doesn't feel right, please rinse your hair right away. And that's why I am recommending you to go getting your hair done professionally with someone who actually knows what they're doing. So yeah, now that that's all said and done, I'm going to be doing this. Um, I know some people like to like measure with like ounces and stuff with their products but I honestly don't care um, I'm going to be mixing very little because it's only going to be my bangs that looks more than enough for my bangs and the rest I'm just going to close and seal off and before I start mixing anything I'm going to start putting on my gloves and then it's time for the developer. This is the consistency you want. It's goopy. It's kind of runny. It has a thick viscosity. And uh, I'm gonna go section by section. That's what I'm gonna do. Voice over time. My bleaching process had no real rhyme or reason. I was kind of careless when applying the bleach because it was a very small portion of hair and I really didn't have to wait to do the roots last so I just decided to put the bleach all over I'm not gonna lie I was pretty afraid of bleaching my hair um, even though it was such a small portion because I was afraid it was all going to melt off and I was going to have chemical burns everywhere but as long as you do it correctly and you follow the instructions that's not gonna happen so i don't know i did use aluminum foil just so i could retain some heat in the process and as well so the bleach wouldn't dry heat does help lift the color um i'm not i did i decided not to go into much detail about um volumes of developer and all that stuff that will be a whole other video if you guys are interested in that but yeah that's it that's this voiceover
So maximum time I could leave this on is 45 minutes. That's what the packaging says. I'm going to leave it on for 30 and then I'm going to check back every 5 minutes after that. So let me put my timer. So I'll be back after 30 minutes. So it's been 30 minutes. Let's check this situation. Oh. Oh. So I'm going to wait 15 more minutes and then I'll be right back. Hey, so it's been 15 minutes. I'm going to rinse this off because it's already starting to get itchy. And once I'm done with that, I'll be right back to update you. I may or may not have to re-dye this whole situation again. So these are my bangs. This is how they look like. I like the color, but um, I'm going to head. I'm going to go ahead and um, dye them green. I'm going to be using Electric Lizard by Manic Panic. And yeah, I'm just going to use my fingers for this stuff because um, I don't care if my hands are stained green. I just wanted to put this in here. My hair did not look as brassy as it does in the video. It was like a very pale strawberry blonde. It was a really, really nice color. That's why I said that I liked the color. But yeah, that's all. I decided to use this green and when applying it, it kind of just looked yellow. <laughs> dye is coming over here to this part but doesn't matter because this is not really going to penetrate the cuticle in my hair so I'm going to get another small piece of aluminum foil and I'm just going to put that all over whatever is dyed I would have bleached it this all over again but um, I don't want to risk frying off all my hair so Maybe next time, maybe in a couple of weeks once my roots start growing, um, I'll dye it. But it's going to look very, very cool. So I'm just going to let this process rinse everything off and I'll be back with the finished look. So this is the final look as you guys see. It looks far more yellow than it does in person, but it's kind of greenish, like a yellow green. You can't really tell, but yeah, my makeup today is inspired by my hair. But um, I was expecting it to look fluorescent orange, fluorescent orange, fluorescent green. But since my hair started off like an orangey yellow, it probably just neutralized the orange. But um, I didn't want to bleach it twice because I don't want to fry my hair off. But it just feels dry. It's just, it's something different, something new. I really like it. And I actually added more green to it so it could look a bit more greener. But on camera it just looks a bit more yellow. But I've been thinking on just like doing some strips along my face, the same color as this. But um, I'm planning on dyeing this a different color I don't know if I should go pink I've been thinking pink like a bubblegum pink or um, blue um, I should totally go blue for um, BTS's um, Map of the Soul shadow no it's 7 it's called 7 Map of the Soul 7 because their album cover is going to be like a little baby like teal bluish color so yeah um, yeah that's the look it looks like this, and yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you guys did, please give this video a big thumbs up and share because you can see more of my face. Please subscribe to my channel, make new videos each Sunday, and please be sure to click on the little bell icon so you guys can be notified whenever I do upload. And yeah, that's going to be all, kiddos. See you guys next time. Bye!